Real back to this dance. Rick. Movado. Hmm. A this issued to the Gully God a challenge? Unexpected. Yes, we are surprised. But of course, in these days, nothing should surprise us. Now, Drake recently released a song titled Only You Freestyle. And in that song, there is a direct reference to the Gully God. And of course, many are taking this as a challenge and not just a challenge, but a diss. Also in this song, Only You Freestyle, he acknowledges Popcorn and the Gaza too. But he references Cassava Peace and also references the bridge. Now that is taken as a direct reference to the Gully God. Now we all know that Drake is a rapper. And of course he has been chilling in Barbados with Popcorn. As Popcorn celebrated his 32nd birthday in July. And with other members of the Ovo family. Now we never expected that when this song was released. That there would be a direct challenge and a reference to the Gully God. But guess what? When it came out, that's exactly what happened. Now we all know that Drake has been dabbling in dancehall. And of course, Popcorn is signed to his label as well. So he is very, very much quite knowledgeable about dancehall and about clashes. And also about making references to other artists. And of course, the consequences that would follow lyrically. So let me know what you think about this because I am going to share those lyrics with you. And of course, I will definitely be putting my own spin on it. And of course, Movado must respond. Hope you heard clearly what Drake mentioned in his track titled Only You Freestyle. Now, of course, this is the section where he acknowledges and gives a huge forward to Popcorn and Vibes Cartel's Gaza Empire. Now, this is what he said Link Pop Skull in Gaza, but not that Gaza, but still it's a Maza. Simply saying that it's amazing. Now, when he reaches the part where he issues his challenge and apparent this to the Gully God, this is what he says. One piece like cassava, but we let bridge them burn like grabber. Boy, four in the clips and one in the eddy. And no shake man, I hold that steady. Your man love pose with the thing for the picture. Your man should have bust that thing already. Your man love essy essy. Yeah. Can't back chat to the prezi. Now, subscribers, I want your opinion. I need you to leave those comments in the comment section and let me know what you think about these verses that Drake the rapper has decided to just basically offload through his single Only You Freestyle. Now, we all know that this track is getting a lot of attention because of the specific sections that references cassava and the bridge now does cassava really reference movado's hometown cassava piece does the bridge burning actually mean that it's the end of that friendship that existed between movado and drake at some point in time in the past now we all know that that friendship was discontinued I am not really sure of the full details, but of course, you can always find out. Now listen to another. Of course, Movado did not allow Drake's track to just pass by without issuing his response to Drake's apparent diss. And this is what Vado posted. From your look clout, a copper to your mouth. No. Trust me, this gets more intense. This is direct. This is a response to all that was mentioned in Only You Freestyle. No, that was a perfect response from the Gully God. Of course, 
we all know that he's a lyricist and he doesn't and he has never backed down from a challenge so guess what he took on drake now i want drake to respond do you want drake to respond yes i do i want him to respond he needs to send out a new track and respond to what the golly god has said now also i want the golly god to release a track as well because i want this to go on I know you want it to go on. This is what dancehall is all about. People issue this is them exchange them this between each other, and of course that is only good for them and good for the dancehall industry because it keeps the fans happy, and of course it keeps the fans talking. So guess what? Leave your comments down below. Let me know if you think Drake should respond to Golly God's um response and let me know if you think golly god should release a track right counteracting what drake has said in only you freestyle now of course this is what i know you all love and what you would love to see because this is dancehall this is what dancehall is known for clashes right and when there isn't a stage show for a clash to go on of course the artists just clash by just exchanging this via songs My name is so like comment share and subscribe leave your comments down below let me know what you think about this apparent battle between drake and vado do you want to see an all-out lyrical battle between the two of them well i would love to see both artists releasing track after track basically exchanging words and telling us all that we all need to know about what's going on and also what they think about each other and what is going to happen yes we all know that vado is very very good at this well this is drake's first time issuing uh this but guess what towards a dancehall artist that is i don't know what happens in the rap world however we want to see him battle it out with vado and we want to see who would win i mean of course i think vado would win but what do you think would happen i don't know maybe drake has learned a thing or two from popcorn and from any other dancehall artist that he has been interacting with but who knows vado is very very much experienced and he is an original dancehall artist so fans tell me what you want do you want to see vado beat and teach drake right or do you actually think that drake will team up with popcorn and release a track um that is a direct response or an exchange of words between him popcorn and movado so it would even get more interesting if all three were involved in this lyrical battle but you know you know we will tell you all about it here so remember like comment share and subscribe thanks for watching